Hey, what's up, my friends? It's Mr. JB walking out with my family. Got Laura here. We got little sleeping, baby Luna baby. sleeping. It's uh, morning time in Encinitas. I'll give you a stroll down our little our little view here of our neighborhood. There's Moonlight Beach, which we walk down to every day and go for walks and all this other good stuff. And we're heading to Lofty Coffee, which is the jam if you're in this part of the neighborhood. And I was thinking about you guys, because um, I haven't talked to you in a while. And we're going to talk to you about something today. Laura has insight into this as well. Um, well, I know a lot of you guys probably saw the Futuristic Academy launch, where what we focused on was how do you live a life and build a business that's completely aligned with your values? That is 100% new paradigm to you. It, it represents your authenticity, your soul, your purpose, your life's work, your calling, the most possible meaning. How do you build that business? And I want to talk about one nuance today of what happens once you usually get started walking down the path of building that business. And what happens is you get started and you go, 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 go. And like anything, you're inevitably hit with your fears, right? You're hit with some type of challenge. You're hit with some type of ambiguity. You have a new obstacle that arises. And there's this, this natural tendency when that happens. And, I, and what I really want to do for this video is I want to make this okay so that we all don't beat ourselves up. But there's this natural tendency when that happens, we have this almost like gut instinct, this reflex, where we revert back to what we know. So I'm sure you might have been in a situation before where you really want to do something new, you really want to change, you really want to, you know, invent a new behavior, and something happens, something triggers you, and it's just like a reflex, and you revert right back to what you know, right? And this could look like in business, you know, doing the same tactics or strategies that you didn't want to do, you know, going back to the same old headline, even though it's five years old and you're bored as crap of it, going back to whatever the heck it is, you just revert right back to what you know. And um, this is okay, right? It's natural, but it's not what creates the new paradigm. Uh, we have to be able in spite of our fears, when we're heading into building a business based on totally new values and a totally new paradigm, in spite of our fears, we've got to be able to do what, Laura? Change fearlessly. Change fearlessly. <laughs> what else do you have to say about that? There, you keep walking. I'll walk with you. <laughs> It's all a part of the process. Stepping into your dreams and what really matters is something that churns up everything in you that could make it not possible. So all those fears come up and you've got to face them as you go. It's part of the process. That's right. And while you're going and while you're facing them, what's your number one advice you could give somebody to change fearlessly and not revert back to the old ways, but continue in the bold, unknown territory of their, of their heart and of their vision. I think you have to close your eyes every morning and get in touch with what really matters and why you're doing it. And take time every day to settle into your center and know what drives you. And the truth is, just like you said, you are going to revert. And the most important thing to do is not beat yourself up because that just creates more and more retraction. So That's the more right. you can face that fear and not beat yourself up and have compassion for yourself in that moment, the less you're gonna need to do it. That's right. Thank you, baby. Welcome. My friends, we love you. We're almost at breakfast, but hope that was valuable. Move forward with joy in your heart, with love in your step, and you will accomplish everything you ever wanted to accomplish a million percent i believe in you talk to you guys soon